Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to make a Minecraft skin and upload it to your computer on a Chromebook. You can also do this on any other device. So, what you first want to do is open a new tab and search up the Skindex. You want to go there and click on Minecraft Skins, the Skindex. When you come here, you will see all of the Minecraft Skins that people have made. I'm going to wait till this loads. It has now loaded some of these skins. You can use most of these skins if you would like, but I would I'm choosing to edit my own skin for the purpose of this video. So what you want to do is once you're at the skin decks, go to editor. When you scroll down, if you already have a skin there, you can go up to the top top right corner and click reset skin. This is what it will first look like. First, you want to choose a skin color. I am choosing tan. You want to click on the space that you want to fill it. And you want to make sure that if you're having a skin color to fill the whole body. To do that, you can click on the bucket. You can drag the body to the back of the skin and make sure to fill in the sides and up above. So once you have made sure that everything is filled in, you want to start you want to start on the front of the skin. And what you want to do first is to create hair. I'm for I'm going to choose brown. Make sure your bucket is off and turn on auto tone. What you're going to do is create hair. I'm going back because that was on the top of the head. So you want to make sure your body is not on the top of the head. I'm going to do that right now. I have just now noticed that I've not filled in the skin, so we are going to click on the color picker and sh click on a spot where it is. You want to click the bucket and you want to fill it in. Then you want to go back to the auto tone and click the color that you want for hair. What we are going to do now is make hair. So basically, I am going to go back and I'm going to put a dot on the top of the head just so I know it is the top of the head. So now that I'm not on the top of the head, I will need to fill in the spot where the face is. So in auto tone, it will automatically change to the color of the hair. So I'm going for a flowy hair. So let's do that.
You want to fill in the spot that you want to have your hair in. Let me do that. Once you have filled in the spot that you want to have your hair in, mine is lagging. So we are going to fill in the hair. Perfect. Now, you want to create the eyes. I'm going for a black eye color. You want to make sure they're close enough together where it doesn't look weird, but you want to make sure that they're far enough apart where it also does not look weird. Now, what you want for the lips is a darker tan which we are going to turn off auto tone and go back. So what you actually want to do if you're making a girl, you want a lipstick, I guess, color, like a tannish pink. So we are going to try and do that same color right now. So now what I would like to do is actually reset this whole skin and start over. What I'm going to try to make is a pumpkin girl. We are going to wait until this loads and then we will go and do this whole skin. So what you want to do again, same tan color. So, I want to go for a tan color, fill everything in, that's orange. So we are going to fill in the whole skin. And make sure it is all filled in. So let's fill it in. Okay, so now we have filled in the skin color. We are going to go for an orange. Like a pumpkin kind of orange. Here, let's fill in the top of the head. Then let's add some leaves. I want to go for a dark green color for the leaves, which is more of a flower crown, if you ask me. So let's do the back of the head now. So now we are getting started on our flower crown. And basically you get everything that I'm trying to do here. So you can make your own skin however you'd like. I'm really bad at it, so um, I'm not even going to try. Um, so what you want to also do once you're done with your skin, if you want to save it, you're going to download it to your computer or upload one that you have already made. 
Make sure to like and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye!